Dad's a brilliant packer. I need nothing. He, he can pack in a half an hour everything. That's because he doesn't dress. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I'm not naked. I wear clothes, but I wear a uniform. I bring a little bit too much, but not that much. But I left my best earrings in England, and I was afraid to have Jenny's. And where are those food. earrings now? They're in Jenny's jewelry box, yes. and I'll have to we get them. We always leave she, things behind. When she, don't enjoy France because they make you feel like an idiot, which you kind of are. Never a Boeing 737 Max that crashes, and those assholes should be in jail. Such a great Catherine response. Bicycles. Ugh. I keep thinking every day I take a walk, I keep thinking I gotta get on a bike. Um, I think they're not designed for women's bodies. I think they really hurt your tush and other parts. I don't understand. Is it better riding. for a man with testicles? No, well, they made a seat for your little testicles, honey, to put right. They fit right in that. Have little you seen groove. my testicles? They don't fit yes. in that thing. Well, that's that's what they considered. The thing it. is like this. They didn't consider the that. Like that. For is women. that for a testicle? Excuse Look, me. You can't. Yeah. Even, no, you no. can't even get. You can't Excuse even get. Excuse me, honey. Ginger. But they they did. They put a little rest in there. I think I'm gonna invade my think, testicles. I don't understand. <laughs> I really don't quite get why a bike is better what would than you walking name my or hiking. I think. What would you name them? Sunny boy. <laughs> but there's two. Would they both be? Sunny boys. Sunny boys. <laughs> Thank okay. you. I love that idea. Okay, good. Okay. As long as I live again, I will not be on a cruise ship. When I'm 100, you can't get me on one of those. We went on one once. It was the most obnoxious American experience of my life. They, they, you're with like a hundred relatives you can't stand and didn't want to know. You're captured in this place. Dad disabled, dad disabled the loudspeakers on the cruise ship because he kept hearing, okay, time for shuffleboard. <laughs> Blimps. Oh, it's so sad. We went in one, didn't we? Yeah, somewhere. But you know, when the, when anywhere. those exploded, that was the end of that. Honey, that was a Hindenburg. That was quite some time. I know, but you know, we did the industry in, honey. You don't exactly. Well, see we went. We in went in a blimp. Do you believe fucking Elon Musk is on the cover of Time magazine? That made me vomit. Vomit. Did you space travel, space things. You know, bullshit, lots of bullshit. lots of fancy rich not, people going not, in not space. Not on your what a fucking uh, waste of time. I wouldn't pay for it myself, but if some guy who has nothing but money wants to ask me to be in it, I'd go up in a heartbeat. Why? I want to feel what it's like to be weightless. I'd love to look at the Earth from a atmospheric uh, perspective, and I'd really like. I don't want to just go up and float around for thirty seconds. I want to go to the fucking moon or another star. Or well, well, why? What about saying, oh, if you give me a free ride on your spaceship, can you give a million dollars to these ten organizations? I want to say that I think personalized space travel is just the little seed of of the unbelievable arrogance of the ultra rich that think they're they don't have to fix the mess they've helped create on this earth. They're just going to go and populate Mars all by themselves out there. I'm, I'm so own. fucking disgusting. But Mr. What's his name? Not Musk. What's the guy? Bezos. Hi, Mr. Bezos. My name's Mandy. I'm an independent person. If you want to invite me, I no, will bring and her. Don't and I'm not going to give me any shit. Don't and I'll come have into fun. my house unless you're on your knees asking for forgiveness. We'll have fun. Willing if you want to give money to people, people great. People and if you don't, job. I'm okay. You know, I mean, look, yeah. if you take me to space, I'll put up with anything, Ugh. you know? Uh, I do. I do love home. I do love home. No. What? I love it too. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, Dad? Do you get homesick? I do when I'm in high altitude places because I really long for less altitude.